Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Pisces September 7, 2022. You can be especially open with talking about, or analyzing, very personal matters today, although you can be a little detached about it all. It's an excellent time to clarify your goals in a partnership or see your own needs from others more clearly. A sun-uranus aspect influencing the day can inspire you, making you more in tune with your need for new ideas and experiences. Friends and acquaintances or new plans and dreams can be part of this inspired feeling. Courses, networking, teamwork, and publishing opportunities can be areas of improvement. Friends and alliances formed through your studies or extracurricular activities can be in focus and successful. You especially enjoy sharing viewpoints, personal philosophies, and opinions with others and making exciting discoveries in the process. While a strong day for you on social and mental levels, consider that because the moon is balsamic, it's best not to push forward with new plans just yet. The sun continues to energize and revitalize your ninth house of adventure, expansion, and unknown territory, but it is now approaching a sextile to Uranus via your 11th house of associations, community, and sense of belonging in the world. Is this love interest worth the risk? There's an exciting journey ahead. But before you embark on this magic carpet ride, you're being called to follow your heart and use your discernment. Both the Moon and Mercury will be transiting through Sagittarius your 8th house of mergers, shared resources, and soulmate connections bringing awareness to the foundation of your connection. However, something could seem out of the box. A typical financial and professional opportunities are worth considering. The Moon has left your opposite sign, for Sagittarius today, implying that you are ready to think outside of the box when it comes to your fiscal security. The moon is rather level-headed in Sagittarius, so you can take how you feel out of the equation when considering your investments, shared resources, and assets. As you consider your opportunities, think about which ones are unique to your long-term plans and goals. You may find that a unique or unlikely opportunity could dramatically transform your finances for the better. Just four days before Venus and Mars, the planets of money and passion are due to return to your financial sector, the moon leaves just as Mercury and Saturn align here. As well as leaving you with your financial instincts and imagination fueled, this is a read on planets that are already giving you the smart head for money and the resolve to take your financial power back. Ignore everything your big head tells you. Your heart is the real master right now. No matter where it leads, make sure you follow along like a baby duckling. Today you can feel in tune with your most important emotions. You might attempt to focus your energy on creating affection instead of simply unleashing it. You need plenty of affection in your life in order to feel your best. When words fail, try to give yourself the opportunity to express your needs through affecting others in a positive light. You have a special connection to the economy. Giving your time or money to a needy cause helps you feel pleasantly connected with the world. The energetic essence of this day can give you the oomph to take some action in your personal life. As you know, not everything can be about work in your life. However, incorporating this into your day-to-day -day regimen can be challenging for you. If you take the time to make some plans to dedicate a certain amount of time each day or week to the people who are important to you, this can be an essential step towards creating more balance. Use your time management skills to make this happen. As much as Mercury and Venus will be using their last weekend together in your income sector to keep heart and mind on the same page, the stars are aligned in a way that could make this a defining point in this financial year. Two days away from leaving, Mercury is focused on leaving you with the smart head for money needed to keep your head in the game while a friendly aspect to Pluto is linking this with the planet that is keeping things on track professionally. Even having the moon in your financial sector is putting both sides of the financial fence into perspective. The moon's departure from your relationship sector yesterday has not only left you more emotionally engaged but with a better sense of what you want from your relationships and what they need from you. This wrapped up a seven-day period that saw the moon focus first on matters of the heart and then your relationships, 
with these first visits since Venus left Aries a chance to cement your expectations on both fronts. Our eyes in the sky. Today, the moon in Capricorn connects with Jupiter, Mars, Uranus, Venus, and Saturn. We can attest to the fact that by activating five planets, the lunar energy, as well as emotions, will be powerful throughout the day. First, when the moon aligns with Jupiter in Pisces, it broadens the heart and spirit. The energy helps us become more open and kind to others, something we can all embrace at the moment. Next, when the Capricorn moon connects with Venus and Mars, both of which are in Capricorn, we can expect to feel as though we're taking action to align ourselves with relationships that acknowledge our truest desires. Finally, Uranus asks us to shift our mindset, while Saturn pushes us to take action around personal evolution and growth, which seems harder than ever. Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, and the Moon are strongly defined, which is why it's important to pay attention to themes of commitment and loyalty. You might have to do some work to earn others' trust, or vice versa, which you might not want to do, but the presence of Uranus makes it necessary. In the morning, the Capricorn moon sextals Jupiter in Pisces, inspiring us to enjoy life's Epicurean pleasures. Notably, we wish to be charitable with what we have. This could be as nuanced as sharing our philosophies or beliefs, or as simple as sharing a meal. Honesty reigns supreme, engendering trust and kindness. Our idealism shines through in our interactions. Even those who meet us in bad faith may be disarmed by our sincerity and instead resolve to act honorably with us. Before noon, the moon trines Mars in Capricorn. Both of these influences are exalted in their signs, making the melding of these energies an embodied and harmonious one. Events transpire which make us aware of our strengths. Hard work and patience help us meet our goals, yet we won't feel like we must rush to the finish line. Having a positive attitude and adopting a pragmatic approach delivers a stress-free success story, whether in business, family matters, or even asking a crush out on a date. Although our frustrations are valid, perpetuating harm is no way to reconcile our past. In fact, through these confrontations, we become more practiced at supporting and healing the inner child who craves validation. Be your own best cheerleader now. It is our birthright to express ourselves, take action, and forge new paths, no matter how loud we are or who we might disturb in the process. It is not our responsibility to make ourselves palatable for others, and rectifying this ideology helps us attract true friends and allies. It might not be the most romantic energy around, but this common sense lunation helps you deal with reality in a very practical way, allowing you to get the tough stuff done in a simple and very matter-of-fact manner. What will make your life easier? Think of the little details and now that will help you make the transition to a new season a little easier. Organize a closet or your work desk. Get a jump on spring cleaning, dust your bookcases and computer equipment. Start on all those little tasks that require attention to detail, because you have plenty of that now. And keeping your mind busy helps keep it off of bigger issues and problems that can lead to catastrophe-type thinking. 